Hi, welcome to the first episode of Mateo Desperately Tries. This is a series where I try out jobs that I know I would get fired at. I've been fired from every job I've ever had, including Michael's. I'm here with Avery Willie, who's the hot bartender here at the Comedy Cellar in New York City. And Avery is a professional bartender, and Avery is going to show me today how to, how to be a bartender, right? So we're going to figure it out. We're, we're fucked. <laughs> Hi, I'm brand new. I don't know how to bartend. I'm horrified. What's like 101 bartending? Like, what do I need to know? First thing, you need to know how to set up the bar. We got ice situated already. You need to know where all of the bottles are. All right, so we've got our, what did you call these? These are our speed rack. The most common drinks we'll get. We get a vodka soda, gin tonic, all of that stuff. Right vodka here. soda, that's what I order. That's what all homosexual men order. It's good, especially coming up with summertime. You gotta get, the, get them abs ready. It's Avery's got great abs. Gays. Okay, Give them a call. <laughs> All right, so I know so I know an Aperol spritz. That's very Italiano. First component we want is gonna be Aperol. We're gonna get some Prosecco. Should I be doing this? Okay, how much Aperol do we put in? So I like to do like probably like right there. Let's fill it out. Right. I mean, it's so pretty. Perfect. There? Okay. A little more, a little more. All right. It's summertime. Great. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, fuck. Is that too much? A little bit. Wait, I want to try and do this, but I'm always afraid I'm going to Oh, be very somebody. careful. One time during the show, I didn't hold the top and just flew off and... Yeah, just, what do you mean hold the top? <laughs> hold the... Just like make sure it doesn't blow off when you take I'm this. I'm <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm afraid it's going to knock It's going to be good. It's because... <laughs> I'm so good. So now we want to hit it from the side. Oh, why? Because it's the bubbles, you don't want it to bubble up too much because you're going to waste a lot of wonderful drink there. Okay. And then to the top. Oh shit. Let it settle. Oh yeah, we have to garnish it with oranges. It's an orange peel. Okay, we're all going to have to share this because I can't be drunk at two o'clock in the afternoon. I've got things to do today. Oh, you, be careful because there a lot of people lost fingertips to this. I could use the peel. Not on my... I don't just peel down like this. Uh, you can or you can work it. Like that? You miss some skin though. We want to get enough of the like skin that we get. So we so once we we twist it, we twirl it. The oils from the citrus of the skin come. Oh god, this is so complicated. People just want to get drunk. It's <laughs> We're doing all this. Oh, every single drink, twirl it so it nice mix. But you know, and it's so funny because it's such a pretty drink and it's not worth it for the person's like, oh, I'm not an apple spray. How is it? I mean, it's really good. Great. Oh, for a second, you so made good. an amazing drink. I'm so good. <laughs> Wait, try it. Tell me if I fucked up. I can do something that's two ingredients. It's amazing. It's good? <laughs> can you teach me how to pour beer? Yes. I do not know how to pour beer. That's how we wash all the this, dishes. It looks like I went to a sex shop. <laughs> I was like, hi, I need to clean my dishes with the same thing that goes after my ass. <laughs> I've never heard this when I'm doing a show. I've never heard R2D2 just working his ass off <laughs> in a fucking pond. We got a slop sink over here where we throw all of our okay. empty glasses so we don't mess up our good right. sinks. What do I do? I feel like I'm in Little House on the Prairie. <laughs> you dumping in the brushes? This, this? is where our uh, like soapy water is? Yeah. Get in That's there. Hot. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you gotta get in there. I don't <laughs> You gotta make sure it hits the bottom. Do you understand? Well. <laughs> Give me some poppers, then we can talk. All right. And then we dip it in this bad boy. Okay, and this is sanitized? Water? This is the sanitized, and then I didn't put a plug in here yet, but this will be just uh, clear hot water to clear that off. And that's it. Put that bad boy right here so it can dry off. I'll be ready to rock and roll in about two minutes. God, that was so stressful. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I'm not a beer drinker, but if I was gonna pick one of these beers, I would pick a Guinness. All of these beers are poured differently, but a Guinness is a specific type that you have to pour that. Because the way that it settles, it needs a little bit more time. All right, so Guinness. So Guinness is always in a pint. So, so I couldn't special. use this glass. You can't use these. And this has already been douched by R2D2. <laughs> okay, so Guinness, how should I pour it? First, we wanna start, make sure this is dark. <laughs> This is the first beer, so we gotta let it run for a little bit. You wanna Boom. wait till it runs clear. That's for... Now we wanna basically. hit it with a 45 degree angle. Okay. So you're good at geometry. See how that's all settling right there? It looks like it's raining. So, yeah. It's all coming together to build the black drink that it's gonna be in the end. Wait, but that's done? Shouldn't we go, shouldn't it be so warm? It's, we gotta let it finish. Okay. And then, so when I first did that part, I pulled it to this side. Right. But with Guinness, it's the only tap that when I push it that way, it only go a little bit so that I can, I don't, I don't. Stressful. What kind of person usually orders a Guinness? A lot of Europeans come in and love their Guinness. A lot of Irish come in and love their Guinness. Oh, Tati, can I have a Guinness, <laughs> my and lad? They're the, and, and they're the ones who are just like, yo, you know a Guinness drinker from a person that just saw a Guinness, just like, I'm gonna get a Guinness. I'm just gonna be wasted by the end of the day. I'm like, hi. 
<laughs> like I've, oh, I do have shows tonight. I mean, it's great. It feels like I'm preparing a Thanksgiving dinner. All right, <laughs> so this is for a Guinness. So, <laughs> hey, you wanna, uh, Guinness, got it. Okay, <laughs> 45 degree angle, right? Press this there. Oh, on there, okay. So it can hit the walls, cause it's coming out all the way. Oh God, I didn't know there was a difference. And then stop halfway. Right there. Stop here? Yep. And now put that down, you gotta and walk just, away. Oh God, there's an ice bucket machine here. Two minutes later. Two minutes? <laughs> gotta let everything settle, so it needs to look, you know. I, the Italians had it right. This was done and ready to go. That's a good look. Right, okay. It looks like a black And now, cookie. remember? The other way. Now push it close, no, nope, not all the way. You don't want to like this penetrate and, it. and that way. But you want to keep it close so it doesn't stir up everything you already let settle. But so like perfect. This. this is perfect. Look, I am so good. I told you, you're professional. Grazie. <laughs> I do like that it has like a, a like a snow globe effect, like May your day yeah. be merry. <laughs> Especially the initial. What do you want to make? A margarita? Do you want a margarita? First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna grab. I'm honest ball. with you, I'm slightly tipsy. Already? I know. I really didn't, I didn't have much to <laughs> Did eat. Did you pregame? <laughs> no, I didn't know. Hi, welcome back to the Mateo Lane show. <laughs> so, the start of margarita is ice and tequila. Yes, my go-to is uh, Casamigos. Blanco. Okay. This is in honor of my Mexican heritage. We're making a margarita. Did you know it was Mexican? Uh, no. Did you know George Clooney made this? Did he really make that? <laughs> Casa I thought he was making coffee in he, Italy. What's he doing he's making? He's doing everything. Screw it, George Clooney. He can't just be Italian <laughs> and Mexican, okay? Well, so only a few of us are that. <laughs> I should be making coffee in Italy and making tequila in Mexico. Well, I'm Italian, Mexican, and Irish. So basically, I've, oh my God, I've made all the drinks that I am today. I made, <laughs> you did this on purpose. No, I, I swear to I said. <laughs> I swear to you, I didn't. We're celebrating my heritage today. Okay, so Back triple here. sec. Triple sec is an orange liqueur. How much should I add? Tell me when to stop. From a little more, a little more. Hook it up. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> so right. now we're gonna get some fresh lemon juice. Oh, margarita sounds really good right now. I'm gonna be wasted by it. I'm gonna be like, yeah, I learned. I learned a lot today. <laughs> You can use a fresh squeezed lime juice. I've always wanted to use this and I've never used it oh, before. Oh, perfect. Okay, so it says LC. We're gonna hit this guy. The M. How not much? all the way, not all the Just way. Just to the top? Not to the top because when we shake this, it's gonna fill it up when oh. the ice melts. So go, go, go. Perfect, perfect. Oh, fuck. Perfect. Okay, is that good? Perfect. All right, where did I put this gun? In the gun holster. Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm in the wild way. Here you go. Wait, can I try this part? Now you want to make sure you seal it though. Oh, fuck. It, this goes up. Oh. It needs to be above your head and you don't want to shake it towards the customer. You want to turn and you also get that nice little bicep pose. Okay. Now shake over your right shoulder. Up high, up high. Like this? Yeah. This is it? Have fun with I'm it. I'm doing this wrong. Have fun with it. <laughs> I'm not having fun with it. <laughs> Wait, you show me though. how, because I feel like an asshole. Is that it? That looks amazing. It does? I did a good job. Oh, okay, we're gonna. So and Avery's smile. doing this while I'm on stage like, what company do you work for? I hate you. See how it's no more ice? Right. That means everything. So you just wanna break up the ice is what you wanna do. And then it goes back, It's you know what, it's resourceful. See, Mex my people were resourceful. <laughs> okay, oh my God, this is it, it's a margarita. I do love margaritas so much. Be careful, you saw how much we put in there. <laughs> yeah, we put in a lot. It's actually really good though. Just making money. What do you think, good? Amazing. It's great. Chim chimini, chim chimini, chim chim taru. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Welcome. Good, Welcome good. to Matios. <laughs> uh, what do you have, partner? You guys got any special drinks today? We do. We have a froth flip top. It's a, it's a, um, it's a mix of great and we also have a uh, Casamigos tequila oh so I'm gonna say no to the first one okay let's uh, do something with that Casamigos Cas okay. can I do that with um, seltzer yes Casamigos with seltzer coming yes. right up 
And do you want it shaken or stirred? Are you not gonna want to shake the salsa because it's carbonated you know, and I'll that might you blow up in your face? I'm the bartender. You're right. You're right. Here. I'm sorry. So I'm why sorry. don't you relax, sir? <laughs> Here's your goddamn napkin, you son of a bitch. Just gonna get some ice. Well, Great. Process. We're just gonna get you some ice. You know George Clooney makes this tequila. Nah. -uh. He does. <laughs> and you wanted you wanted this with what again? I some uh, seltzer, some soda water. Some seltzer, some soda water. Yeah. That that. You know, we here, that's bar talk. Great. No, hey. it's, a, it's a group effort, team effort. We're, do, we're here together. <sighs> <laughs> My wife left me six years ago. <laughs> Still. And then, you know, I like to garnish it with um, lemon. We got some down in that fridge over How there. do you know, okay? This is my bar. <laughs> I've been running this for years. We Here we go. You know what, you're getting an orange. I, that's perfect. Actually, tequila is best taken with orange. With orange? Yeah. I know, I'm part Mexican. I know all about this. Look, you're Good. the bartender. There you go. Yeah. Do you need a card or something? A credit card? To start a tab? It's free. <laughs> we, <laughs> this is, I did it. Great. <laughs> well, that was it. I'm a professional. Uh, I, <laughs> it's clean. Uh, thank you so much, Avery, for helping me out to become a bartender. And uh, if you come to the Comedy Cellar, please say hi to Avery. He'll make you a, a margarita, or he'll, you'll wait six minutes to get a Guinness. And if you like this, please subscribe. We have more coming, and thanks so much. Cheers.